just a quick video, you saucy panthers. I uh, I decided to um, install Virtual Machine and then a uh, Windows XP into that, which was really quick and easy. No hassle, get it all off the net. And then uh, install um, Axis for my Z4 or Z4 if you're an American. Um, it works like a dream. It's really good. Uh, like I've got a recycled chopped up drum brake that I made. Chuck that in via USB going over there. Drum set A. It's all there. It's insane. It's loaded up. So if you go to drums and that, you can uh, audition. Back in hour and the atmosphere. And that's running from the uh, from the rack. Oh, can't really see that. It's all a bit blurry. But I'm chuffed, and it runs seamless on my PC. So I've just got this blown up. It's really good resolution. And then I just run it, and in the background, I'll have my other stuff running, and we're away. I've got a Varios rack unit too. I wonder if that'll work. Not that I'd use it much anymore. There's no need for it, but it's a bit of a quirky little unit. So um, oh, stop that audition. Right. So uh, I did set up the Varios, and in the virtual machine, it works. So if I go to add, I can't really remember what I'm doing here, but tempo backing load. Speed producer is working. I got it working on virtual machines. Wicked. Although I will probably have no use for it. You can pitch up, pitch down. So this was before time stretching on the PCs and Macs were wonderful. It was a bit of a flop. I think Roland knew what it was about. Um, you can load the Jupiter and the 303 uh, virtual instrument within it, which I'll show in a bit. Um, this the predecessor Daft Punk used. I can't remember what it was. A very it was a very phrase type. It was a type similar type of thing. Um, Groove quantize. There's lots of things you can do on it though, because. Um, yeah, so you get six audio channels. You can do the very, very phrase things. You can then bounce that with a multi effect on it and just keep bouncing it and bouncing it and it just keeps rendering it. Um, it's the same uh, technology that's in my MV, but it is a bit more sophisticated that's in the MV, surprisingly. Um, it's more smoother as well. Um, I don't know why. So you can pitch. You can time, sorry, I'm holding this with one hand again. I need to put it up properly. So you can do pitch in, which is like the vocals for, what was that, what's that thing? I can't remember its name, I'm crap at names anyway. The thing that you get free with everything that you can get a vocal and pitch it and re, redo it. You know the one. Well, this is probably like what inspired it all. This is on the, uh, the 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 V the V synth Roland did as well. This well, came up. Managed to uh, flip it over the very awesome and turn it into a Jupiter. Sounds all right actually. Details. You've got multi effects, ring, EQ, phase shift. I mean, that means something like that. <laughs> Harp C, that's going to be good, isn't it? Is it balls? Junior you know Square again. There is the Varios 303. You know it's not going to sound that wonderful. <laughs> not quite. And of course, we've got so many options now for a 303. You don't really need that. Jupiter's nice though. 